this is my Arduino powered locking cat flap uh, we did have a, a, a regular mechanical locking cat flap which used the tags on the collars but we found that the locking mechanisms on these are very weak and a persistent cat can easily uh, push the door and pop the, pop the catch and gain access so what I've done is fitted a nice beefy uh, servo with a, a long locking mechanism um, it's powered by a little Borduino up there um, it's running on 9 volt power just for this demo but it is normally wired into a, a wall socket via an, an AC adapter so the way it works is at the moment this is the outside so the cat can't gain access and no matter how hard they push because this is, is quite a large a large catch um, the servo isn't powered um, when it's in standby this this helps to reduce you know wear on the servo and it also reduces current consumption um, as soon as um, anything's activated it attaches moves then detaches moves back so on and so forth so it's really low power consumption um, I'll give you a demo here this is simulating um, a cat collar there's three reed switches here here and here um, that's that's you know, so if the collar's at an angle, it will still hopefully catch and let the cat in. So, cat comes in, lock goes down for so it's around 15 seconds because they do sometimes they do sit there and do this, to try and get in. So, cat comes in, and after the time's uh, elapsed, it locks. Now, it does that, that movement because when it comes down if, if for whatever reason the door gets stuck about there the servo will catch it and hopefully it will just click it back in um, in the first prototype of this I found that, that, that if the servo came up and hit the door it would go down and rest and the door would remain completely open um, it has a, another fail safe which is this tiny magnet here is connected to a reed switch which is on the, uh, the actual latch and this detects if the door is this side of the um, uh, the locking mechanism when the door is locked so it doesn't lock the cats in and let everyone else in um, so that works so cat comes in if I just position it there this way. so the door is slightly ajar so after the 15 seconds it will come up and do its uh, there we go so now it's detected the doors there and it's locked it again so there we have it it's fairly basic a few little lines of code on the Arduino but hopefully it should let our cats in no one else in and hopefully the door won't get caught or catched on, uh, on the latch or stuck in the wrong position